So I'm gonna show you three dishes today, uh, one of which is a main course, and then we have two desserts. So the first dish is gonna be roast bunk fish with trumpets, uh, roasted salsa fee, and chicken wings, crispy chicken wings. So with the monkfish, we're gonna poach it gently in the water bath. We then roast it in some butter to get a nice caramelization on there. We then serve that with some salsa fee puree, which we just put on a, a little ring on the plate. And then around that ring, we build with some roasted salsa fee, which we get from Wild Harvest. Fantastic this time of year. They also supply us with some great trumpet mushrooms, which we just cook very gently in some butter. We finish that with a little bit of three-cornered garlic. Um, then on top of that, some nice crispy comfy chicken wings, some salsa fee crisps, which just add a texture. Uh, and then we finish it with some monk's beard. Again, it's just come into season. Wild Harvest have it. Um, it's one of those ingredients which adds a nice freshness to the dish. So there we have roasted monkfish with salsa fee, trumpets, and monk's beard. So the second dish we're going to do is poached Yorkshire rhubarb with a white chocolate delice, some crisp puff pastry and a rhubarb sorbet. So the white chocolate delice is a very simple method of uh, just melting some white chocolate with cream. We really want to let the flavour of the white chocolate come through. We then fold some uh, double cream through that, a little bit of gelatin to help it set. Uh, the, the rhubarb is poached in a mixture of stock syrup and grenadine, so it gives a nice colour, nice and pink. So the rhubarb's from Wild Harvest. Uh, also the puff pastry. Then we roll out some lovely all butter puff pastry with icing sugar. Bake that very thin between two sheets so we get a nice crisp texture. And then we also put a little champagne gel on there as well. So that's made by setting some champagne, slightly sweetened. Make a gel from that using some gel and gum and then we blend that to make a, a puree essentially. Then serve on the side nice rhubarb sorbet which just adds a real nice freshness to the dish. So there we have white chocolate delice with crispy puff pastry, poached Yorkshire rhubarb and rhubarb sorbet. So the third dish we're gonna cook is a passion fruit souffle with pistachio ice cream and a bitter chocolate sauce. So the preparation of the souffle is it's a very simple souffle. We take a, a passion fruit puree, which we get from Wild Harvest, we thicken that with some, uh, some corn flour, slightly sweetened with some sugar. Uh, we then allow that to cool down. We then make a traditional souffle in the sense that we take some egg whites, whisk them with sugar, beat a little bit of that into the, the souffle base. Um, we then fold the rest in nice and gently, put that into a mold, and then we bake it for eight minutes, turning it halfway through. And then we serve that with a, a lovely pistachio ice cream. So we use Iranian pistachio nuts that we get from Wild Harvest, they're a fantastic product, really vibrant green. Um, we also make a little crumble from that, which gives a little bit of texture to the dish. And then we use a bit of chocolate, which is actually a chocolate developed by Michel Roux. Um, and we, we get that through Coco Berry, through Wild Harvest. So there we have passion fruit souffle with a bit of chocolate sauce and pistachio ice cream. Mm -hmm.